Hello, everyone. Welcome to this web conference, which is organized uh, as part of the Business Booster Forum. Our partner, CCI Paris, Ile de France, and Bernard Kinet in particular, will present to you how to approach the French market and how to deal with French buyers. Uh, his presentation will be completed by uh, Mr. Zamir Eldar, who will explain how he managed to develop his business in France. So we wish you great success in France and fruitful discussions. Bernard, the parole is yours. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Sharafa. Uh, hello, everybody. So my name is Bernard Kinet. Uh, I'm working at the Paris Chamber of Commerce in, in a department called Doing Business in Paris. Uh, Doing Business in Paris is the, is the department of the CCIP dedicated to the support of, uh, of foreign companies. Uh, I have 10 years of experience and uh, I'm, I'm focused in, in uh, agro-business, green tech, smart city and IT, but we, we have also in the, in, in, uh, doing business exper expertise in art de vivre à la française, which in fashion, design, jewelry and so on, on works. But uh, I, I want to add that we, we, we mostly have a method uh, that allows us to 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 approach uh, any any sectors so um, or uh, very very quickly our mission are to organize b2b meetings program it's it's really uh, my my core business uh, I, I, I met some, uh, some providers on um, some buyers meeting uh, um, um, during, during program of meeting. I also organized special event, a seminar, degustation, networking session, and things like that. Uh, I organized set visit uh, on, on exchange with the, the manager. And uh, as you can hear, uh, I also um, I, I also doing training session. So my, my purpose today is to share my, my experience. I have accompanied a, a lots of, of foreign companies in, in a lots of field, and uh, I, I want to 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 give you practical example. And and what I want to 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 say is uh, above uh, your 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 belief in your product, uh, 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 your motivation on 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 so on. Uh, you 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 have to know that to enter uh, into the French market, it's also a question of technique. You see, it's uh, it's a techniques, it's strategy, it's 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 preparation. So I, I'm going to give you uh, uh, tools, method, and information to 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 that you you can be prepared to to work in in this uh, in this market. So um, a, 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 a brief uh, glance uh, uh, of the of the plan. I, I'm going to give you uh, some key factors and figures uh, that you 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 can have an uh, overview of the French market. After I'm going to give you intercultural element uh, things to know about French people, um, and uh, it will be very helpful for you to know the particularity of, of French people. Uh, after we're gonna see the, the, the buyer's profile, uh, it's a kind of psychological uh, profile of, of, the, of the buyers. After uh, five uh, strategy uh, to approach buyers, uh, it's, it's uh, based on my experience, uh, trade fair on convention, what I call direct approach, organization of commercial event, public procurement, uh, tendering, and the case of, of, of marketplace. Of course, all those approaches can be mixed. Uh, after, we'll see uh, the source of identification. At the end, how to negotiate on, on, on uh, follow the, the, the meeting. Few uh, few uh, few figures about the French market. You see the age. I'm I, I'm going to be quick on 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 this on this uh, matter. Uh, you see the age. Uh, 24% under 20, 50% 20 to 
to, to 59, uh, a population of also 29 million. Uh, the, the figure are a little bit old, but it's uh, the last official figures of the, of the INSEE. Uh, to understand the French market, you see here uh, the, the distribution of GDP by region. Uh, you see the huge importance of Paris, but you also uh, can see that uh, it, it's the repartition is it, it quite balanced among uh, different uh, regions as Lyon, Bordeaux. So don't don't figure that uh, the, the market is only Paris. Uh, it's Paris, Paris is important, but that also uh, important area. Then uh, I'm going to give you some intercultural elements, things to know about, about French. Uh, I, I, I must admit that uh, it was uh, difficult for me to do this job as a French. It's difficult to speak about his, his culture, about his country, but um, I think it can be um, helpful for you to, to, to approach the, 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 French, uh, uh, the, the French market. First of all, there is an omnipresent regulatory of on legal environment in all the, the field of activity, in commercial, social, taxes, accounting. But uh, since uh, about 10 years, there's a real desire of simplification uh, about, about all this environment. But uh, wh what I want to, to say about that, of course, uh, it's, uh, it's it's a disadvantage to have some, sometimes this, this kind of lewdness, but consider it as an advantage because uh, the, the state must be considered as a resource. You have cluster, you have research center, you have regional agency la, like Choose Paris region, you have a development agency uh, uh, like ADEM, uh, you have Chamber of Commerce, you have a lot of actors, official actors, that, that can help you. Uh, even if you are a foreign company, I give you an example. Uh, if, you, if you think about the, the development agency, they are here to uh, promote the, the attractivity of uh, the, the region. Uh, so they will uh, answer to, to your question, if you have a project uh, that interests in France, don't hesitate to, to use these resources. I spoke about ADEM, it's an agency for the, the, the sustainable development. You'll see with the example of Zamir that uh, you can raise fund uh, through this kind of agency as ADEM. So, uh, consider the omnipresent of the state as a resource. It's it's uh, it's not only an inconvenient. It's it's a real resource, and you and you use it use it like that. Another thing, the notion uh, the notion of of hierarchy is very present in the organization of of the of the of the company. Uh, so uh, what what uh, what what conclusion do you do you do you have to to take for for the, this fact who is your your uh, the, the the people who you speak with who is who is it in the in the organization is it, who decide uh, you 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 have to situate your uh, the people you work with in the hierarchy of the company and uh, because you can spend sometimes three hours to convince a buyer uh, about your product, about your service. And then at the end, it will be, oh yes, I'm convinced. So now let's go to see my boss and convince him. See directly the boss, you will uh, earn a lot of time. So be really aware of this notion of hierarchy. 
it's changing because of the teletravail and uh, the, the, the the, the new organization of the of the work due to the COVID, it's changing really, but it's it's still it's still uh, there. Uh, there is a, a culture of writing in France, and so there is a, a formalism in, in communication. So uh, when you, you when you you write a message, take your time take the, 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 the right word and it will be appreciated by, by your, your interlocutor. Other thing, uh, revenue, but you have to take it into account to the promotion of your product. The societal role of the company be, be beyond the economic of commercial aspect. Uh, one figure, 84%, uh, I, mean, I said 84 percent of the French buyer declared being influenced by the responsive character of a brand. It's huge. So use it, use it, and uh, don't only see the price, only see the innovation uh, the, 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 that your product is smart. Think about the societal role of your product on, on, on the company. Uh, last thing, the French market is, is highly requested. Uh, is, so, uh, sometimes I say um, some buyers are, are spoiled children because of that, because we, we, are, we, are, so, uh, we are so requested. So uh, think about innovation. Uh, think about innovation. Uh, it's it's very important to, to, to make the difference in this very uh, requested market. I will speak uh, about that later. Uh, a country uh, open uh, to the world, but um, uh, rooted in, in historic culture and it's art de vivre. It's, uh, it's uh, important for some, some sector as uh, fashion, as food. Uh, you have to take that in, into account. Uh, another um, information. Historically, uh, we are centralized around Paris, as you see the, the map, uh, the former map. But it's, uh, it's changing. It's changing and the region uh, become leader in certain sector. I just want to show you this map. Uh, it's the map of what we call competitiveness cluster. You see in different, uh, cl what is a cluster in few words? It brings together large and small firms, research laboratories on, on educational establishment, and they work together in a specific region to develop synergy and cooperative in, in a project. You see uh, the map of those cluster. If your activity is based of, 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 on the technology, I don't know about transport, about food, about, about spatial, about, I don't know, but think of the notion of competitiveness cluster to approach the market. You see, everything is, is there, they are all over the France, not only in Paris, the, take that into account uh in your in your project in in france this map will be on the on the presentation uh i will share with you after the profile uh, bias it's a it's a, a small uh, psychological uh, profiles of the bias uh based on my experience uh they are highly requested Whatever is the sector, it can be in food, in industry, in, uh, uh, in, in services, in big account, they are highly requested and they receive tens or even hundreds of proposals per day. Uh, Sometimes uh, one of us said to me that it was about 300 offers a day. So uh, imagine. Your product can be the best product or, or services in the world. 
it will be uh, among thousands of of uh, of 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 other product. Um, so to be uh, positive, what what is the the conclusion to 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 have about that? Uh, when a buyer doesn't answer to your mail, to your phone call, it's not that he's not uh, interested. It, it only don't have time. It does, sorry, he doesn't have time. So take it into account. No answer doesn't mean no interest. You have to call three, four, ten times, send a... Uh, uh, a, a huge amount of 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 mail it's uh so um another part of the profile they have a real culture of discretion uh they are you 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 won't find them in social network in directories in, in, on database uh they they want to stay um to stay free so uh, they have a real culture of, of discretion. They are very busy, uh, very, very busy, uh, especially in, in certain time of the years. For example, now in food business, it's the, the period of negotiation with the suppliers. Uh, so you, 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 it's, it's not the, the, the time to, to join the buyer in the, in the agro-food. There is trade show, they have recurring event. They have also the pressure of the marketing department. So, so uh, it, it, link, it links with the, the fact that they are highly requested. Uh, don't uh, consider a lack of response of a non-interest. Okay. Uh, also, uh, they they, they, they take risk in, in investing in your in your product what 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 does it mean it means they are very uh, sensitive they have a great sensitivity about reference label distinction and so on okay they are, they are very uh, it's it's some things they, they, they look at first what is your label what is your your reference? Do you have a distinction, a seal of excellence, or something like that? But uh, don't forget, they remain curious because never uh, forget that they are spe specialists of their sector and they are very involved. And they are, it's a, the innovation is a good way, is a it's a good mean to reach the buyers. Don't say you have you have something to to sell, but you have something to show them. You are you you want to give them an information about something new, and and maybe the contact will be will be easier. It gives you a, a general profile of, of buyers, and uh, maybe some of you uh, have uh, people they know in mind, uh, but take that into account when you will prospect. Um, I, I have to worry because the subject is so, um, is so important. I have select uh, five, uh, five way of approaching the, the, the buyers. Through, uh, through uh, trade show, trade fairs, okay. The direct approach, the organization of event, marketplace and public procurement. I will give you detail on, 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 on each. First, trade fair on, on convention. I won't be so long uh, on the subject. You know uh, why is it important to, to, to go to a, to a trade fair, demonstrate your ability to animate, to promote, uh, uh, show you, you know, demonstrate the strength of your, of your business, uh, increase the visibility, you, you, you can read. But uh, what is important when you prospect through a, 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 a trade show? Uh, forecast, plan to be present for several years on the, on, the, on the show. If you go for one shot, you lose your money. 
uh, buyers need to be reassured, as I said uh, previously. So you have to show your ability to last. And uh, I have a lot of examples that buyers reveal themselves after three or four years uh, of the edition of a show. So uh, if you decide to, to prospect by uh, trade fair, do it on the medium or long time. If not, it, it's not you, 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 you will waste you, 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 your money. Choose where you choose, choose well your fair. Don't go uh, to, to great big international fair. Some, sometimes you have a very uh, uh, specific and, and, and sectorial fairs uh, that are more efficient than that big event. Um, Yes, and uh, that's why uh, contracts are, are, are rarely signed on, uh, on, on trade show, but uh, on trade fair. But it's, it's not, you are not here for that. You are here to be seen and you are here to be seen for, for a, 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 a long time. Uh, just, uh, I want to see something about COVID. Uh, I organized this year a virtual convention uh, because of most of the all of the uh, trade fair were canceled. Uh, the conclusion is that the buyers appreciate uh, virtual convention. Why? Because it's a low rationalization of time. Uh, it it allows the creation of private space. And, uh, and it allows quality of exchange that you can't find in, uh, in, 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 in a classic uh, trade, trade fair. So for the future, for the future, I think uh, the, the, trade, the trade fair will be almost in, in virtual and uh, physical, what, what we call now physical. Um, organization of B2B meeting, what I call the, 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 the direct approach. Uh, for me, it's the best. And it's my, it's my, uh, it's what I do uh, every day. The aim of the organization of a B2B, uh, uh, of, of the direct approach, is to arrange a face-to-face -a -face meeting with the buyers. You aim arranging a meeting with the buyer, S see him face to face, and then uh, you will you will create a relation. You will you will develop something. Uh, so uh, for that, and yes, I see uh, it, it's 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 also you have to show. To the, to the buyer that, that there is a man, there is a team behind the product. And when on organized mission, I, I'm always surprised when I discover the, the people behind the product and, 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 and uh, the buyers have to, to discover you and you have to see him face to face. No, no, no platform can, uh, can uh, can replace that. So what is the methodology to organize such uh, uh, a meeting? It's, uh, it's technique. At first, you, you, you have to, to do the identification of, of, uh, of the, 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 the partner. So um, we'll see that. We'll see that later on the source of identification. I will give you tips to identify potential buyers uh, regarding the fact that, as I said uh, before, they have this uh, culture of discretion. So I will give you tips to, to identify buyers, but uh, it's, the, it's the, 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 the first step. After you have to, to do the qualification of, of the prospect, name, contact details. I will see that with the identification. Then you have to do the drafting of the offer or of invitation. It's in, li it's in link with uh, what I say with, with the 
the the the fact that we like the writing culture so uh, take all the time needed to drive uh, to, do, to 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 write your invitation explaining innovation explaining all all, all your project so you send this uh, this invitation you send the offer and then begin uh, the 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 follow up so uh, at this at this level the follow up you will uh, you will you will meet what i call the dam of the standard today all the big account all the company have a standard and the standard are nominative so uh, it it's very 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 difficult to 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 go through uh, those standards so it means that the information you have to 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 find when you will do the qualification and, and we'll see that after is the name of the people you want to contact it's not the name because the standards are a nominative so you it's an obligation to have the names and after what what uh, what is the consequence of the standard is that you will have to phone five times 10 times 20 times to have the, the the people because you 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 won't have him directly uh, before a, 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 a huge a great deal of 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 uh, of call what i want to say is that you need six to eight weeks to get an appointment six to eight uh, you six to, to eight weeks to get an appointment that the time as i need as chamber of commerce so take that take that into into account uh you 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 have to be extremely motivated because uh it's not very technique like approach but it takes time uh it may be uh, seems obvious for some of you but uh it's it's a fact to take it, 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 it into account and that's why also uh prospection uh is expensive because it takes time okay uh so this is the methodology and then you organize the 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 the, the, the appointment uh what i want to say also is this uh, this exploration is uh, uh can be can be used as a market survey you see all the you 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 you, you will uh, you will harvest all the opinion of the the the, the people you 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 exchange with uh, your product is not so innovative there there is competitors it's too it's too expensive you will have a a a, a great deal of information so uh, that's why this this method is is very interesting you see because it's simple you can do it for from your your your, your country and it's also a, a huge a, a, a not huge but concrete uh, uh, ma market uh, market survey so uh, let's continue because the, the 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 time is running another approach uh, which, which is uh, uh, um, for me uh, complementary of uh, of B two B meeting program is the organization of, of commercial event. You can organize conference, degustation if you are in agro food, a cocktail of, of networking. Uh, for example, if you have an innovation in in uh, in computing or in IT. Uh, rather than do a, a B2B meeting program, you can plan a conference and uh, you, you, you present your, your activity and, uh, and invite. 
invite uh, some some people uh, who can be active. You see, you 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 don't sell a product, you present an innovation, and uh, it's uh, it's some, something for me effective. And uh, the other advantage that you get all the ecosystem, buyers, experts, inf institutional influencer, it, 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 it really upgrade your image. And know that to organize, for example, a, a little cocktail for 40 people, it won't cost you more than uh, 3,000 or 4,000 euros. And it will be uh, uh, very uh, nice in, 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 in VIT. I must be uh, quick on uh, on uh, on procurement and tendering. Note that there is a site called uh, Boamp uh, on which you can search all the call for tenders. You can open a free account to 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 have alert on a specific uh, tendering. You can serve your search and you can have, have online help. Uh, this uh, this uh, uh, service is very effective. Um, know that uh, a lot of market are involved by thunder. Uh, it's the case of hospital. It's the case of school, university. If you are in the healthcare market, uh, the thunder uh, of on the procurement are on. Uh, a way to 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 explore to enter the French market. Uh, it needs to devote some some staff and to 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 take time, but it's a very very interesting. Uh, knowing that it's open to European company and company which we have we have special agreement with France. I won't be uh, longer with standing. It is a technical subject. But uh, you you have to consider it because it's a it's a huge market. Marketplace. Uh, you can also uh, you can also uh, enter the French market uh, from your country or test the market by, by marketplace. You see here it's the number of visitors by months, by, by site, and uh, the visitor by, by days. You see, it, it's, it's, it's huge. Uh, I just give you an example. I, I, I met uh, uh, 15 days ago a German company in the, in the furniture for, for children. Uh, they realized via Amazon about uh, 200,000 of turnover only uh, only by, by the platform. Uh, and now that they, they, they sell with, with Amazon in France, they are uh, interesting uh, French brand as La Redoute, Galerie Lafayette, and so on. So uh, think to begin or to test the, the French market from the marketplace, OK? And you have also the, the B2B marketplace. Uh, ju just one, 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 one figures. Uh, think that 50% uh, of the business uh, is now uh, realized through a marketplace, B2C or B2B marketplace, 50% 50, 50 of, of the business. So you have to include that in your strategy. Uh, <clears throat> The identification of buyers, you can see the major database. Uh, most of them are uh, subject to, to, to fees, but Siren is, the, the, is free. It's the, the, the official uh, database of the government. You can find all the French company by sector, activity, size. Uh, it's, uh, it's free. And I recommend you to go on, on this side. I, I won't go uh, further with the other. 
you have the address, you can go on, on, on and see what, what, what they propose. Uh, the professional social, on social network, it's very efficient source of information. You see by LinkedIn, uh, you will find the name and the, 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 the function of the buyers. And with that, with this precious information, you can go to the standards and uh, as you, you have the name, they will put you in link with the, 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 the people. And after two or three uh, try, if it, 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 it don't, uh, if you don't success, kindly ask the mail of the, of the people. Uh, Often it works on uh, the standard will give you the mail of the people more easily than the, for the phone number. Instagram, LinkedIn are very precious uh, sources of information. Other sources, uh, free and, and efficient. Trade union and professional organization directory. It's on internet, it's free. Uh, Trade show exhibitor list. I used to say, uh, sometimes you only go to a trade show to get this famous list and catalog. It's very precious. And uh, the cluster members and partner list that you can find on the cluster site. Those three uh, sources are very interesting. I have to, to, to accelerate, I'm sorry. During the meeting, out when you prepare the meeting, Please have a translator uh, to, to the first meeting, uh, even if, you're, uh, if you contact, say that he speaks English. He speaks English. As I speak English, I, speak, I, I, am under, I can be understood, but it's not enough to have a, a commercial negotiation. Uh, so uh, it's it's maybe it's an evidence, maybe it's obvious. If you want to do business in France, uh, take a translator or designate uh, someone uh, in your company that that speak French. Uh, it's it's a real key of success, really. Maybe some of you are some of you are smiling, but uh, it's I, I, I saw a, a lot of, of very good contact that 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 failed uh, only uh, due to the misunderstanding. So even take a stage that that speak French, you see. Uh, uh, but I insist on that. Uh, be accompanied by a translator or learn French, but uh, it's another subject. Uh, have a presentation of your company, of course, uh, uh, including innovation, market survey. It's really important uh, in this uh, very um, uh, requested market. Uh, why? Your product, while your service has chance to succeed, only your market survey can 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 say can can can, can say it. So, uh, in your budget of pro pro prospection, in your ticket to enter the French market, do a market survey survey for you, but also to convince the buyers uh, that uh, you have a, a chance to. To, to succeed, new capacity of production, uh, customer support, bring sample on, on demos, of course, production uh, sheet with origin, composition, pattern certification, uh, delivery uh, uh, term, price in, in, in DDP. And so from the beginning of uh, the, 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 the commercial, what, what uh, margin do you intend to to give to the distributor will you give will you give him exclusivity 
uh, it's dangerous to give the exclusivity. Uh, so uh, you, 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 all of that must be ready in your mind and may, must be prepared before the meeting. During the meeting, it's uh, it 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 mean it mean obvious, obvious but uh, uh, it, it's a return of experience. There's no meeting of, of uh, convenience in, in in France for all the reasons I, I give you about the about the buyers. They have no time to for 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 that. So if they receive you, that they are reasoned. You have to to find what is the reason. It can be a good reason, but can be another reason. Uh, so uh, describe their expectation. Is it the cost? Is it the quality? Is it the level? Uh, maybe the suppliers only want to do a comparison, the buyers a comparison with it, its suppliers for negotiation. Maybe uh, he want to, to launch a private label. You have to, to be very sensitive and to, to describe the intention of the, of the buyers on why he received you. Uh, you have to reassure them about the, 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 the distance and the language will not be a break. Reassure, it's a word that is uh, sticking to buyers, you have, you must always reassure them. Designate a referent in your company that speak French for the reason I, I, I give you, uh, I give you, uh, I give you later. Keep in mind that the buyers invest in your product. Uh, he, he will invest uh, time, but also money. For example, if, if uh, if he, he, he have an, 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 a network of, of sailors on, on, on the ground, uh, he will have to pay with that. And who will pay the communication? Uh, because it's something, the, 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 how will you make the product live? And uh, how, what will you invest? How will, will you help? The, the 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 buyers to sell your product it's the whole question what will be your contribution you have to answer to all that and the the animation uh, just just one example and and you see hypermarket you see leclerc and so on they ask uh, that uh, a provider plan the mi a minimum of eight animation a year on the, the on the on the shop. Eight animation a year. You see, don't do enough effort to sell your product. You see. So it's an example, and, and uh, of course, the, the uh, Bernard, nous vous avons perdu. Est-ce que c'est normal? Zamir, nous vous entendons pas. Voilà. Oui, moi, je suis là, mais en effet, Bernard est disparu. Parce que Bernard a son micro éteint. Très bien. Alors, le temps qu'il revienne, peut-être, Zamir, pouvez-vous nous, nous parler de votre expérience d'investissement ici en, en France et de développement en France D'accord. Donc, je mets la présentation. Uh, Est-ce que je suis réactivé Oui. Uh, écoutez, je, je, je vais juste conclure là-dessus, Zamir. Uh, uh, I, I just want to, to, to conclude in, in one word. Uh, even if your, 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 your project, uh, your, your product, your service have a success of esteem, 
take care to 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 give news very Je, je pense, Bernard, que, que le micro ne, ne fonctionne pas très bien, que la connexion ne fonctionne pas très bien. Donc, nous n'avons pas entendu le, le « le one word of conclusion euh, ». Donc, euh, nous laissons la parole à M. Eldar qui nous, qui nous présente son, son, son projet d'investissement. The, the, the phase of the, 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 the... Um. Monsieur well, Eldar? Think, yes, I, I, I will take over from here, I think. Um, yes, so, please. Th thank you for inviting me. Finish for me. Uh, uh, thank you for inviting me to present uh, our, um, our story. Um, what I will try to do, my name is Amir Eldar. I am the CEO of uh, Bioplasmar, a startup company based in Israel and the co-founder of Poetique, which is a company, a joint venture with the Bell Plasmar and Veolia here in France. And I will try to give you uh, very briefly the experience of a startup company, its life over the years, and how uh, the encounter and the help of uh, Bernard Quenet and uh, the Chamber of Commerce in Paris help us to establish a, a company here and a joint venture in, uh, in, in France. So uh, to start uh, with the uh, idea of um, um, a, a startup, oh, just a second. Yeah, we, uh, Bioplasmar uh, had in mind the problem that is well known to everyone today in the world is the plastic. The production of plastic is going very, very fast and very high in the past uh, decades. Uh, and it's reached now about half a billion tons produced each year. And the problem of this production is uh, half of it today goes for a plastic uh, packaging material. And, and this uh, uh, material um, is generated globally, most is not recycled and not incinerated. So this plastic stays with us uh, uh, for many years and uh, it goes into uh, many areas um, uh, in the ocean, in the earth, everywhere. Just a second, I need to make sure. Yeah, so, so again, the problem is the plastic. Um, one third of this plastic is made for a single use uh, and most of it is disregard within a year. So after we use this plastic, uh, in a period of 12 months, this plastic goes to a garbage cans and stays in the atmosphere all over the world. And we know that uh, a part of this goes to the ocean, at least 8 million tons per year. And this is a great concern. We know that uh, scientists are saying that uh, in the next uh, few decades, the weight of the plastic will be higher and bigger than the fish weight in, in the ocean. We know also that this um, uh, plastic does not decompose completely. And uh, the biodegradation of this plastic says in a nanoparticle that enters into the body of all the species, including uh, the men. So what is the solution for this problem for Bioplasmar as a startup? We decided to use the nature, the circular economy as part of our raw material. And uh, the raw material is in fact the wood and the compost that is generated each year by, by trees and plants that are taken uh, to incineration places or to compostable places. This raw material for us can be transformed into products that can replace eventually the plastic. And the product that we have created as a first one is a flower pot that can biodegrade uh, in the soil after uh, only a few weeks. This is the product, you can see it in the middle here. So to produce this product, we are using vegetable and compost, uh, um, green waste. <clears throat> we have adapted the shape of this uh, product, specifically the flower pot, to uh, the industry and the market that we are targeting. And we have calculated that the price of this product should be sufficient attractive so people will in fact buy it. And all this is in a circle that use the local economy 
and the local circular economy. We are using the raw material locally and we are selling back our products locally. So how this works, it's you need to find a watershed, in fact, in between the moment that the uh, flower pot is in the warehouse and in the nursery, what you want it to be resilient and resistant, and the moment where it needs to degrade in soil very rapidly. So how to find this equilibrium is the uh, unique uh, technology and innovation that Bioplasmar found. But this unique innovation doesn't mean that it's uh, the way to succeed. In the way to succeed, as you know, probably, or you don't know, but most of the startup are at risk and over 75 to 90% of them fail for all kinds of reasons. So entering into a startup, it's, it's a risk. So to be successful, having a startup company and having an idea, first you need to have the right idea and strongly believe in that idea so you can convince others that this idea is the right one. Once you have the idea, you must make sure that you have the market there, that the market is sufficiently robust and strong, that it will mitigate all the risks that you can have there, and make also sure that the market will be there in the future. As the hockey player Wayne Gretzky said in the past, I skate to where the puck is going to be, not where it has been. So you make sure that the market that you see today is going to grow to the place where you want him to be also in the future. Of course, root the, uh, choose the right technology, the, the innovation, have a unique uh, uh, sale uh, proposition and be focused and, and simple. Don't try to invent something too complex uh, that it will be hard to sell. And uh, the pen versus the pencil is a story that I'm not sure it's a true story, but uh, once uh, uh, you remember the, the space race between the Eastern and the Western uh, blocks um, uh, was very uh, robust in the, in, the 19, in the 60s, 70s, 80s. And once the Soviet Union disintegrated the meeting between the Russians and the Americans, they discussed the issue of uh, the space. And the Americans told the Russians that they have invested a huge amount of money and time to develop a pen that can write in space when there is no gravity. And the Russians laughed and said, well, we gave them only pencils to, the, <laughs> to our cosmonauts. Um, choose the right employees and the right partners in execution and capacity and make a proof of concept before you go into the market. And this is where uh, the Chamber of Commerce entered into my story, at least, uh, my personal story and the story of the Opus Now. We had the right employees, we developed the right technology and so forth, but as a small company without uh, funds, without uh, a lot of money and without a lot of resources, we needed to have partners that will help us to take um, our technology to the next stage, which was crucial for our uh, success. So uh, I will explain how we did that, but you need also to have the wow effect. So your product needs to be something that people will say, wow, this is very interesting. I've never thought about it or that it will give something <clears throat> in the emotional part and not only uh, economical and financial. And finally, you need to have tenacity and determination because the number of moments of doubts during the way is so uh, intense that you must really believe in what you are doing. So our uh, company uh, from the birth of the idea in 2011 and creation of Bioplasmar went into trials in the kitchen in the beginning. Then once this work, we uh, industrialized the, co the, the, the concept a little bit in 2013. We started to use in China uh, a place where we could start producing these pots under our idea. And in 2014, we had already something that started to work. And then in 2015, after we have invested a lot of money and so forth, and we had a prototype, we didn't know how to continue, what to do from here on. We needed to have a real proof of concept of someone that will be interested in the future to buy our product. And we also needed to have a partner that will help us uh, in many ways to produce uh, to get the raw material, uh, to have the relations to the clients, to the big clients at least, and to have the um, strong uh, 
uh, finance uh, capabilities. And this is where uh, the CSE came into the picture. I um, met uh, Bernard Quinet. We have discussed this lengthily and he helped me since 2015, 16, to find a place to do the uh, proof of concept and a partner with whom we could establish relationships. So we found the Mairie de Paris, the, 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 the Paris municipality people and the Veolia company. And with this, we did a very big uh, proof of concept, a test, a real life test in, uh, in the city of Paris. This enabled us to negotiate with the Veolia after this test, uh, an MOU and thereafter in 2019, at the creation of a new company by the name of Poetique, and in 2020 to create a manufacturing site that is near uh, between Châtellerault and Poitiers in, in, in France that started production at the end of 2020. So what was the role of the CCE in the success from the moment we had this issue of what to do next until we have succeeded to create this uh, new company uh, and industry. So first of all, uh, the information. We need to understand as, uh, as Bernard showed you in his presentation, what is the economical, social and industrial environment in, in France and how to, navig to navigate the system in France to uh, understand who, uh, with whom we can do what. Then, <clears throat> We, I got advice from uh, Bernard, uh, analysis strategy, the market study, and how to implement this market study in the real life of uh, Paris. Uh, this was the POC that we did with the uh, municipality of Paris. So we needed to find the right person. We need to go and meet that person in the municipality. We need to convince that person that this is something new, innovative, and that he is an interest as a, as a very big city in the world to start the first uh, uh, international trial. We then needed to convince all the gardening part of the municipality to participate in this uh, in this book, uh, which was very successful at the end, but was very difficult uh, to convince at the beginning. And then we screened the partners. Veolia eventually came as a very good partner, but this was a process that took also time and effort. Um, and, and then to sign the agreement, uh, the CCE was always there to give me advice and to accompany our uh, strategy of success, which is uh, the creation of Poetic. Um, <clears throat> so why, why this was a success or why it is uh, at the beginning of a success? Because uh, Veolia and Bioplasma, Plasma, uh, Bioplasma are very compatible companies. Veolia is bringing to the table <clears throat> the knowledge of the use of the raw material because we are using the organic waste that uh, Veolia is an expert in. Uh, Veolia also knows how to implement uh, and to construct industrial uh, lines and, and, and plants. Um, they have also the relations with the clients because they are very close to the municipalities and to uh, many officials in the, in, in the country and they have access to financing. We, on the other side, we have an innovation product. We have created a technology that is protected by patents. Uh, and uh, we have the experience of creating the first prototypes and, and POCs that enable the rest to be successful. The last point that I want to stress here, uh, because I think it's important, uh, and, and Bernard mentioned that Paris is not uh, the only place, uh, we created our company in the Vienna area. And this was very interesting experience for me personally, because Finally, it was easier to go to the Vienne and create a, a plant in, um, in Poitiers, around Poitiers and Châtellerault, because it's a small community. Everyone knows everyone there. Uh, there is a rapid exposure to uh, local officials when you are creating a, a, a place for new people to work, when you are creating an industry, when you are investing there. Many people in the region immediately comes to you and they are very interested in participating in, in that uh, venture. They are sensible and eager to innovation. 
it's easier to win local award, which we received uh, last year. And this made us a huge exposure, of, in fact, not only locally, but a recognition as a national coverage that we didn't expect from. And the circuits of uh, funding and raising money and, and talking to people and finding the right uh, uh, subcontractors and all this uh, helps a lot and saves a lot of, of time. We got uh, uh, grants from ADEM, from the recovery plan in France and from the regional. All over, we got more than 2.5 million euros of grants, which is quite uh, impressive in a an year and a half. So uh, what our idea is to be a low carbon print company, as you saw, we are trying to deal with a major problem, which is plastic in the world and the pollution there. So the idea is to create local uh, plants with the uh, local resources, the raw material, the, the personnel, the research institutions, schools, subcontractors, everything should be local. Even the customers, the consumers and the distribution, we believe should be uh, localized. This is my presentation. Thank you. And I think I stand on exactly the time that was allotted to me. Um, Bernard, we don't hear you. You are in, on mute. I don't know if you want to summarize. Yeah, maybe you hear me now? Yes, now I can hear you. Uh, uh, Zamir, uh, uh, thanks a lot for, for this testimony. Um, um, and uh, and uh, it, 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 it's, um, I, I, it, it shows all, all the work we have done, uh, and uh, it shows that uh, a foreign companies, company can succeed in, in France uh, by using the right, uh, the right mean, uh, the, 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 and, and the right tool. So uh, thank, thanks for your testimony. Uh, You're welcome. I stay at your entire disposal. Uh, you will have my coordinate uh, on, the, on the presentation and uh, Sharafa uh, uh, can uh, put you in link with me for, for the future. Thank you for your attention and I hope to, to see you in, in France uh, uh, very soon. Bye, bye everybody.